But before I lost my sight and, and my mobility, I was a very active person. And I always wanted to have a crack at a triathlon or something like an Ironman. But unfortunately, those um, are dreams now. So I think of little challenges, and one was swimming. A couple of years back, my daughter gave me a challenge where I had to do eight hours of non-stop exercise. And that, and that was a um, but alternating between cross trainer and um, indoor row. And so I thought, yep, yeah, let's give this rowing one a crack. Um, and one of the main reasons why I do it, it, apart from having an active life beforehand, is with my medical condition and lack of mobility, you know, it's quite easy to get a little bit tubby. So it's, it's a good way to keep the fat off. So I feel comfortable I can re reach that eight hours. I just have no idea on what distance I'm doing at the moment. I, at the moment, I've just been concentrating on endurance. Uh, so yeah, next three months, it's definitely um, build up on um, endurance and speed. And full training, full tip if we were doing it. Um, we'd do an hour and we'd probably cover around 17 kilometres. So that's a full Eric Murray Olympic capacity. The best part about it when you do challenges like this, you know, you ultimately, you do the preparation, you do the training, that's what Mark's been doing, you know, getting ready for it. We'll get the machine set up for him. He's got a few more months to do that training. And then it's just about planning it out, you know, and if you spend 40 minutes on it, you jump off, have a bit of a break, and then you do another 40 minutes. Um, hey, you know, we've knocked this thing out in a day or two, and it'll be amazing to see it, see it happen. So these challenges are bringing normality to my life. Uh, last year, I swam the harbour the Auckland Harbour Bridge Swim, it's a two kilometre swim, and I did that as a fundraising event for the Neurological Foundation. And so I had to set up a new challenge, and I was thinking, I tried this about maybe seven years ago, and I didn't quite get there. So I thought that would be a good challenge to actually bang on the head. 